hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel in today's episode i'm going to show you how we can create a snowstorm effect using the unity particle system so let's get started start by creating a new particle system and rename it to snowstorm underscore vfx uh, reset its transform and uh, uncheck emission shape and render we don't need this one we will create a new one effect particle system and rename it to snow underscore particle system after that inside renderer check the max particle size to 3 and uh, we will set the default particle to this one we don't need extra texture okay make sure it is at zero 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 after that set the y position of your parent object to 40 let's see in the game view okay okay after that inside shape select box and set the x rotation to 90 here set the scale to 100 on x and y you can see that is a big box inside emissions set the rate to 30 and uh, set the start lifetime to random between two constants and the value will be 5 and 8 okay after that set the start speed to also random between two constants And the value will be 15 and 25 okay now set the size to also random between two constants and the value will be 0 0.5 and 3 now scroll down and check collision change this one to world okay here dampen will be 1 and bounce will be 0 0.1 now check color over lifetime and add a keyframe here and make this one go to 0 okay then check size over lifetime select this one here select this one add a key here and then bring it here now inside collision set the collision scale radius to 0 0.5 now it's done we have to duplicate this effect and rename it to snow particle underscore okay next what we have to do is we have to set its size start size to constant and the value will be 2 after that we have to set its uh, position to 30 y to 40 and z will be 0 Set the rotation sorry you have to set its position to 30 40 
and also the rotation to 60 and minus 90 and 0 this is how it will look we'll adjust the position later on or we can drag it here a bit okay now we need a plane on the ground and let's increase the size to 100 or maybe 50 okay and set its y position to zero the plane is too wide let's assign it um, its material drag and drop it to the plane and change the color of the material let's put it to black reposition the camera position it somewhere here so we can see it properly okay whatever is happening okay now go back to your snow particle underscore 2 and as you can see it is moving in the other direction we can adjust its position according to our requirement and after that what we will do is where were we okay we have to set the start lifetime to 3 and 5 3 and 5 okay speed to 30 and 50 now we are making a storm we have to check noise where is noise noise and inside noise we'll set the strength to 2 and frequency to also 2 okay now we will duplicate snow 1 again and we will rename it to snow underscore particle underscore 3 and uh, we will check velocity over lifetime and uh, we'll set the orbital y value to 1 and uh, that's it so this is it and I think we need to increase the emission to our liking and for more snowstorm we can increase the values and this is how it looks i hope you enjoyed the tutorial make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos we will see you in a new video goodbye